Breakfast with meteorologist Beverly Perry, only on Fox 47 Morning News at 7. It is a beautiful start to the day on satellite and radar. Nothing really to be found, not even a cloud across the region. We have high pressure nearby, paving way for the sunshine out there. And if you haven't stepped outside yet, it is very nice and comfortable. Temperatures, they're in the 50s. We have 53 in Lansing, Ionia, 59, 58 in Jackson, and the Hillsdale area sitting at 60 degrees. The dew points, you remember yesterday, they were in the upper 60s to about 70. Front move through dried out our air. We're looking at dew points in the 50s and right in the upper 40s too. And these dew points really won't budge a whole lot as we go throughout the day today. So it's going to be feeling very pleasant all day for us today. So through the 10 o'clock hour, we'll push temperatures into the upper 60s. More of a westerly breeze as we go throughout the day. Lunchtime mid 70s and we will we'll be topping out near 80 degrees this afternoon, but that will be a pleasant 80 degrees and will be sticky for us. So high pressure is nearby. There's the shower activity associated with that cold front. Just saw a few showers move through. Wasn't really major, but we do still have a chance for seeing showers and thunderstorms, but that is going to be holding off until our Wednesday. So today is looking quiet, pleasant and warm for us. We'll keep the winds out of the west about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Showers to our north though should stay there. We may see a few clouds creep in from that, but other than that, not looking too bad as we go into tonight. Overnight lows will fall back into the 50s with mostly clear skies and tomorrow. We're going to start the day off with some sunshine and then we will be increasing our cloud cover as we go throughout the day. Now a warm front will be nearby the region that's going to push some shower activity into our neck of the woods. Looks like overall the shower activity will be on tap towards the afternoon hours to the south. And then we're going to increase our chances, especially once we get towards the evening hours. As that front moves a little further north, we could see shower and thunderstorm activity, some of which those thunderstorms could be severe, producing hail and damaging winds. Something to certainly keep an eye on because it could shift and stay further south. So further north it goes, the better chances of severe weather we have. So this is the SBC outlook for Wednesday evening. Again, this can change. We're many hours away from this event. We are in a moderate risk for severe weather, again, for damaging winds mostly, as well as large hail. Can't rule out the possibility of an isolated tornado, but those conditions can all change, so stay tuned for later forecasts. This is all Wednesday. Today, looking really good. Right near 80 degrees, mostly sunny skies, a very pleasant one. We're going to keep those humidity levels low today. Mostly clear tonight as overnight lows fall right near 57 degrees. Showers and thunderstorms later on in the day. Best chance towards the evening. 78 will be the high. 76 for our Thursday. We'll have a few lingering showers and thunderstorms into our Thursday. And then we'll be clearing everything out, especially once we approach Friday. We're looking at the sunshine returning with highs right near 80 degrees.